Hey guys, welcome to a new SK Food Reviewer review. Um, this is bringing to you the new can designed moose head lager. I like it. It's got a dark green coloring instead of the uh, before it was a lighter green coloring, I think. And it's still an independent brewery, still the oldest independent brewery in Canada. Uh, on the side here, you can see that it says established 1867 um, it is union made it says on the side fiercely independent it is a logger uh, look here it says Moosehead Breweries Limited St. John's New Brunswick which is on the east coast of Canada so that's like uh, the Maritimes that's like past Ontario and Quebec that's like on the ocean so it's beautiful out there um, it says return for refund uh, Okay, on the front here, you have the Canadian, or the maple leaf, I guess, and then it says, The beard of, that defies the odds, founded in 1867, we were born with Canada. Six generations later, we're the oldest independent brewery in the country. So they have to be doing something right. I mean, you don't just survive that long and produce a terrible product. <laughs> Unless... I don't know, but no, I would say not, so here we go. This is in can form, you can get it in bottles, you can get it on draft, you could probably get it in a tall boy somewhere maybe? I don't know about that. Um, let's see here. That's funny, it doesn't say on the side or the front here what it is, like percentage wise. Oh, it does, 5% alcohol. Yeah. Uh, and of course, you know, you have the iconic moose on the front, which is always, always very cool. I love seeing his, uh, it's just such a good portrait. Um, so anyways, yeah, it's got a thick head, nice gold color, like the color is beautiful. can hear the crackles um yeah so is this a beer that you guys get where you live does do you uh do they sell moosehead where you live i know that they sell it in the u.s i think that didn't make much sense but i'm pretty sure they sell in the u.s um right off the bat the taste is refreshing It's actually really delicious. It's not like overly watery at all. It's got a lot of flavor for a 5% North American style lager. It hits you right up front and then it hits you the whole way through with flavor. I mean, I don't find this to be a watery lager at all. Um, I don't know why, I don't know if it's because they're East Coast Maritime beers, or if it's because, like, um, there's a reason why, like, I don't know how old Alexander Keese is, but, like, a lot of people I know, they'll, they'll either, like, if they're going to the beer store and they have to pick, like, a Maritime beer, a lot of times it comes down to this or Keese, and I prefer Moosehead over Keese. Keese is a good beer, but I think I like Moosehead more. You can see that there's still some white lacing. Yeah, no, this is a great beer. I would, I would imagine if you were gonna try to show someone a lager who's never had a, like beer before or never had a lager, and you didn't want to disappoint them with something really, like, not very good. This would, this would suffice. Suffice. This would be perfect. Like. They would get everything you'd want out of a lager in the taste, in the look, and the, the design of the can looks cool, you know. I mean, I would love to have tried this beer throughout the ages just to see if it's the same beer, because it is the oldest in the brewery, but yeah, no, it's very good. It's very, very good. To me, when I rate this beer out of 100, uh... I'm taking into account like everything, like the taste, the style, the uh, 
the coloring, everything is kind of getting like considered and it's basically the same score as like a school rating, like if you're getting a 90 that's pretty awesome and then if you're getting a B that's great and then if you're getting a C that's good, if you're getting a D that's passable and if you're getting an F it's not, it's failing. So for me this right here is like, I'm putting this in the B range, this is an 87 out of 100, this is definitely a standard of logger that's high and it's a very good logger. I would I would I would say this is a logger you could drink um you could take to any event. Like you could take this to any family function, friend function, barbecue. And people will enjoy it. I think it has a lot stronger taste than some loggers do. Um I think this has a stronger taste than like Coors Banquet maybe even. But it's good taste, so yeah, give it a shot if you ever have the chance. And thank you for checking out the video. I hope everyone's week is going well. What are y'all up to? Um, I know it's like back to school for some. Everybody's got their own thing. So uh, keep it tuned in to SK Reviewer Channels Studios. We'll be bringing you more content. Thanks again.